Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we start a new series on the channel where we preview each Chesterfield game in hopefully 5 minutes or less. In each episode we record, we'll be joined by some special guests who will each voice their own opinion on the forthcoming fixtures. So without further ado, let's get into the first preview. And also, many thanks to all the guests that appear in today and all their socials will be linked below. So, on Saturday, Chesterfield travel to Altrincham with a large number of Spyrite fans back in the boys and Chesterfield are hoping to maintain their unbeaten run to start the season with three wins and one draw. Falkirk side are coming off an absolutely heartbreaking late draw against Oldham, a game which is filled with fan and player controversy. However, Cook has implemented a confident, free-flowing football and style into this Chesterfield side and I think it's only a matter of time before the tactic starts to click. When players such as Ryan Colclough, Armando Dobra and Liam Mandeville are on their best form, they are probably the best players in the division. Hence why I feel this draw is nothing to worry about for his Chesterfield fans and I think it's just where we're going to get started. Moving on to the opposition, Altrincham. They're a club that are constantly moving up in the right direction at the moment under Phil Parkinson and Neil Sorvey. Alty also recorded their highest ever league finish in the National League and their highest ever points total in the National League last season. Altrincham are coming off the back of a 1-1 draw against Boreham Wood and are another one of the unbeaten sides in the National League with one win and three draws to start the season. Now, Altrincham have a squad that is brewing with talent and forward Regan Linney is definitely the one to watch for the weekend's fixture. Now, Alex has already talked about Regan in his video, but I thought I'd also talk him about him as well. He was signed by Alty back in February from FC United of Manchester and so far for the club has scored 12 goals. Three of those 12 goals have come this season and in four appearances that's pretty impressive. He's proven to be a really good investment for Alty and he's definitely a one to watch for the season as well as the game on Saturday. Another player to look out for is winger Chris Conkark, who Altrincham signed from Fleetwood in the summer transfer window. The club record signing and Conklock have been on two previous loan spells at Altrincham. Now I don't think this fixture is going to be a pushover for the Spyrites, but I am going to predict a win. My score prediction for the weekend is going to be a 2-0 victory, with hopefully Armando Dobra getting his first goal of the season. Now, let's move on to our guests and see what they have to say. So, Altrincham away on Saturday. Um, it's going to be another tough game, I think. I think over the last sort of year or so, I've really begun to rate, you know, the type of football they play, the fact that they do try and play football. And obviously they're a team that have caused us problems in the past. I think obviously the fact that we signed Ryan Colcliffe from them has shown that, you know, they can recruit well and they can have some key players. And that brings me on to like Regan Linney. Uh, signed him last season from FC United of Manchester where he was banging him in in a lower tier. Came here, scored a decent amount uh, in the second half of last season and has started this season with three and four as well. So I think he's their man to watch. And obviously we've not kept a clean sheet yet. So... Will it be a tough ask? Yes. Do I think the boys can do it? Yes. I mean, I think we'll get back to winning ways. Um, it'll be interesting to see how we line up for the two games with it being two games being so close together on the Saturday and Monday. But I'm going to go for a 2 1 Sparrow's win. I'm going to go Will Grigg and I'm going to go with Armando Dobra. Alty away at Max for Chesterfield. It'll definitely be a game Paul Cookshire will look to return to winning ways in. In previous seasons, this, is, this has proved to be a game that Chesterfield have struggled in. Last season, they only narrowly won 2-1 and 1-0 against Altrincham, and the season before, lost 1-0 away and drew 2-2 at home. Both sides are undefeated this season. Chesterfield sit third on 10 points, and Altrincham a 10th with 6. My score prediction for the game is a repeat of last year's clash away at Altrincham, 2-1 to town, and the goal scorers will be Liam Mandeville, who's Chesterfield's top scorer this season, and Jamie Grimes. You might think, you know, it's a bit odd, but Chesterfield look really good from set pieces this season, um, and that is why... I've got with Jamie Grimes. Altrincham away up next, and uh, you know it's going to be probably one of the more difficult ones to predict. They've got off to sort of a similar start to us. You know, two wins, two draws. We've only got two more points than them. You know, they're one of the only undefeated teams left in the league, if I'm not mistaken. But so yeah, I think it'll be one of the more tougher fixtures, especially towards the start of the season. They've played sort of a similar quality of teams that we've played. So there's nothing to really go off really saying on you know why one team can't beat the other. They've obviously done quite a good bit of business bringing in Joey Jones and Justin Donoway from Solihull in the summer. So hopefully um, we don't see too much of them because they can be quality players if they're playing you know up to their full sort of potential. Um, but I think on the day um, we'll sort of edge it and I think it'll end up being either 2-1 or 3-1. I'm going to go 3-1 to the Spyros.